Guys, the car is broken. I can't leave. Holy fr frick you. No. <laughs> Chill as art. These are the legends behind the convenience store. Night delivery in Aka, 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 Munt, Munt, Manto, Munt, Aka. Yeah, so it's Aka Manto. I, I I assume I'm pronouncing that right, but this game, we're not here to talk about any of those. But by the way, the convenience store, one of my favorite games that I played on my channel. And I'm pretty sure it was like my 30th video, yeah, so it was really early on in my channel. But today, we're not here to talk about any of that. No convenience store, although I do want some snacks. You know, some Starburst jelly beans. Star this game here today we got called is the radio station. Now, I started it real quick to see if it would run okay. And this is the most ominous loading screen. Masaki got sinned. Masaki died. One day I found that message right after I woke up in the morning. That can't be. No way. But I like big butts. <clears throat> but I just met him the other day. The man who was happily talking that his radio job was getting on track died. I couldn't believe it. After hosting the radio as always, he was found dead at the radio station. The cause of his death is not clear. Not clear? What does that mean? The police have given up on the investigation. Early on classifying the case as a suicide. Suicide? That's bullcrap! That's BS, man! For Sorry, I'm trying to get into care. I apologize. <clears throat> Sorry, I, I'm, I live in Hollywood. I don't. I'm, I'm gonna move so I can- I'm not going to. Okay. That day, that day something must have happened on the show. I decided to find out what happened to my brother by myself. I mean, see, it, you know what would be a really fire horror game idea is if there was like a co-op, like and like just an indie or just an indie game with co-op, not like Resident Evil or not like I'm talking like an indie game with co-op, like a game like this, and you could play it with a homie. That would be so fire, bro. Oh man. Okay, so we got, I, was that a flash? This flashlight is the size of my torso. All right, we got a key right here. What does this go to? A car key. Can I pick it up? Why am I, am I holding the key? I'm holding the key like a freaking soda can. That is not a Coca-Cola. Uh, letter from the radio station owner. <clears throat> the key to the radio station is in the mountains, or in the mountains is in the mailbox at home. You may take it if you need it. Hashimi, I'm not gonna even. Chilla's arts, like, uh, style, the ambiance and everything about it is just so, Creepy dude. It's so ominous like the whole time. It keeps you on edge get get on get on car Oh, I need the key I wasn't even what the f what was that? I have not been doing no cardio My homie broke the car when he sat down. Okay, so we got a map here. Is that where I'm at? okay? So I'm at the house that's circled or Is that where I'm going? Wait, can I dr hold on wait? Can I drive? Ah! I didn't know I could drive. I thought like it was gonna. Oh my! I already crashed. Are you? Sick? Why is backing up so aggressive? Okay, just take it slow. You know, I. This is why I don't have a driver's license. Take it slow. What is that in the middle of the road? Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I already crashed again. I need to head to Jiffy Lube, bro. Holy, cr dude, this thing is. Oh, that's where I'm at. Oh, I couldn't see it because it was behind my gear shift, my shift gear, my 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 stick. I don't drive if you couldn't tell. As you guys can see, I got the Christmas tree in the back. I can't really point at it because I'm trying to drive and I already crashed, so I might as well point at it what, that way. Oh my gosh, I keep hitting things. I got the Christmas, look, I, once it's October, I start getting jolly. Like my, like I start growing a beer belly. I start like wearing red hats for no reason at all. I start growing gray hair or my hair starts getting gray. Y'all can't tell because I can only see it because like it's one of those spiritual things. Yeah, so that's basically what happens around October or November or December or, okay, where am I going? Oh, I passed it. I gotta go, oh, oh my, oh my God. No. Is this it right here? Is it? Nope, I just crashed into it. Why is the bat? Why is backing up so aggr Relax! Oh my gosh. God, how do I get out? Oh, this is the owner's house. Enter or not now? Enter. Duh. Okay, so we're at the house. Okay, this is my flashlight, right? Oh my gosh, this flashlight sucks! All right, where am I supposed to? I need to find the mailbox. <clears throat> oh, right here. I got the station key. Saving with one dot. Why not three? Oh, wait, am I? 
Am I still playing? Can I go in the house at all? Can I can I do anything here like other than grab the key? Cause I really want. Uh, well, that. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that looks a little bit like blood. Now maybe he just got like you know some stained glass done, but it definitely leaked past the glass. That is not just the glass. That is a serious problem. Okay, maybe he'll get like a you know water hose or what do you call that thing with a, the, a pressure washer? Clean that off. Not that big of a deal. You know, blood doesn't stain that easily. I wouldn't. I wouldn't know. Now I just gotta backtrack and head to the radio station. So I gotta take a left up here, and then we'll be on track. I feel like looking at this map. I crashed. I'm stuck. I, I broke the game. I feel like looking at the. I feel like looking at this map is gonna like they're gonna jump scare. Why am I not? Back up slowly. There we go. Yeah, I'm a professional driver, by the way. I drive for NASCAR. Um, I'm, I'm a really good guy. <laughs> I've been driving professionally for about 12 years now. So basically, ever since I was six years old, I was just born with the gift. You know what I'm saying? And I and I had like really long toes, so like I could just stretch over to the gas pedal and the brake. It's really just a talent. Like I was saying, they're definitely gonna jump scare me by me looking at this map. There's gonna be somebody like in the corner of my eye. Okay, we're in. What was that? I feel like I could have parked this better. Like that's kind of. Leave the area. Thank you for giving me the uh, option. I didn't know I could leave right away. Okay. So what? What is this? We got a oh question mark. What? Uh, ten yen. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. Okay. Let's go on the station. I need the station key. I thought I grabbed it. Did I not grab? Oh wait, no. I have to. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> I'm a professional horror game player. Is anybody in these lockers? <clears throat> Sorry. You just have to be sure, you know what I'm saying? I would have been scared. I would have been like, what the frick? And then I would have banged my knee on the locker and then, bang, 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 you know? Listen, but that's just me, you know? What was that? Oh, that's a clock. Okay, it's exactly midnight, so that's that's perfect. What is this, a tape recorder? All right. Well, I think I need a tape because it's not letting me interact with it. Oh, well, that's convenient. And that's also blood. I'm telling you, just, you know, quick pressure wash. You'll be all right. Get me out. No, get me out. The doors are no. Okay, I can leave. <sighs> Alright. Alright. I'll just I'll just be out here. Masaki's horror story? Hello there. This is your host. Oh. What? Okay, what he's talking way too fast. It is a letter from Toko. My classmate has a sixth sense, and this is a story about her when she was in elementary school. She was born with her power. When she was a preschooler, it wasn't too extreme. She couldn't see a ghost clearly, but she saw foggy figures and also felt certain presence. Before she became an elementary school student, she started seeing them more clearly. It all started when she found out that no one else could see the man. Okay, so she, her special power is to see ghosts, who was always standing at the same spot. She always began to feel the horror of being able to see sense then. A couple was having tea at a cafe, but the boyfriend had no leg. A pretty girl was playing in the park, but she was transparent. Fortunately, she couldn't hear them. Are they talking trash about the ghost in the, in the cafe drinking tea? And maybe because of that, they did. This dude is a super speeder. I think it was when she was in fifth grade when one when one ghost started following her. It seemed that the ghost was always saying something, but she couldn't understand what it was saying, which annoyed her. One day, an incident happened. She was playing with her friends that day, and it got dark without her realizing it. So she was hurrying her way back home, alone. Because it was dim, even a little noise scared her. And that's when she was spoken. Good evening. She turned back and saw a middle-aged man. Are you alone? I could give you a ride home. STRANGER DANGER! That's why you gotta start screaming. Blow a whistle. She was scared by the man. She declined the author and tried to walk away. Offer. But the man grabbed her by the arm and said, I'm telling you, I will give you a ride home. Nut shot. She was so scared that she couldn't even speak. Then suddenly the man screamed and ran away. She looked in the direction he was looking at and there was an unusual ghost. Was the ghost watching over the child? One out of seven. My brother's voice? Said there are six more of these tapes. I have to find them all. I have to I have to commentate on six more of them? I don't know if I'm up for that. <laughs> okay, is there anything else in here that I need? Um 
Okay, there's another room right here. No, I don't see anything. Okay, so he was telling this story, and th this is what I'm gathering so far. He was telling this story on the radio, and it cursed, and it was cursed. It was like a cursed story or something. So I guarantee you one of those ghosts bodied him. I guarantee you that's what happened. Like he was talking about the story, one of the ghosts got upset and he didn't know it was a true story. And he got bodied. Oh, we can go outside? Okay, hold on, let me keep let me keep checking this place. Is there another room? Okay. What is it, a fridge? Uh, vending machine ticket. Okay. Well, I feel like I'm about to get jump scared now, so I'm gonna go ahead and... <laughs> Leave. I mean, look, that wasn't easy. Look, this game isn't even that scary. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, okay, where do we gotta go next? Um, it said that we needed... Oh, there's a vending machine icon. Alright, so I'll head there next. So we need to grab six more tapes. We need to find them, I imagine, all over the map. I don't know if there's gonna be a jump scare where, like, somebody's just on the side of the road and just staring at you. But if, th if that's not in the game, Chilla's art, you you need to. This is a vending machine area. You need to add it. Whether in this game or another game. You need to add something like that. That would be terrifying. Okay. So we're at the vending machine. I don't even know what this means. Oh, man. Public phone. Oh, that coin. Dot, dot, dot. You never look up, do you? Oh. No, I don't. And I'm especially not now. Oh, my... Guys, I... Oh my, it's a tape. I thought... Ah! Oh my gosh. I thought, dude, I thought a dude was going to be sitting up there like this. What the frick was that? Oh, the door closed. I thought somebody just walked straight in front of me while... That's blood! What? Th Wait, there's one, two, three, three, six, nine, three, six, nine, twelve. There's twelve tapes in there. Oh my gosh, did I not know three times? <laughs> well, I need a code. So I gotta find a code. I don't know if I have to find it here or somewhere else. What? A UV flashlight, huh? Oh, can I find a code somewhere? Oh! Two, one, three, four. Uh, is that- wait, or two, one, four, three? Two, one, four, three. Uh, two, three, one, four. Seven, six. I think honesty is key here, ladies and gentlemen. Google is my best friend. <laughs> you know what I mean? I can't believe you've done this. Use food ticket? Wait. Do I want to use that right now? Can I use the food ticket on any of these? Wait. Which one do I want, though? Okay, what is this? That's, the, that's like ramen noodles, I think. Or these are like noodles. Um, what do I want? Oh, what is that? Oh, that looks like a, a burger. Oh, get the burger. Can I get the burger? Can I get the burger? Can I get the bur- you, Yes, get the burger. Um, I have a burger. All right, let's head back to the car. I don't think there's anything left here for us. So we got one, two, we got two tapes in one spot. That's a W of my book. What the frick was that noise when I got in the car? That sounded like a hydraulic issue. I might need, I'm telling you, I need to stop by Jiffy Lou. Alright, so what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to. F <gasps> Are you serious? I am so sorry, PETA! Click off the video! Oh. Uh, are you. I just ran him over. That was extremely disrespectful. But we can all confirm that that was. Oh, I clicked off the game. But we can all confirm that that was not my fault. Yes, he ran at me. I did nothing. I did nothing. He was the size of my car. I don't know how this thing is still driving, to be honest. So what I think I'm going to do, what I was trying to say, was I'm going to do, like, a massive, uh, like, uh, putting in every single tape. I'm going to find every single tape and then play them all at once. That's what I'm, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm, if that's even possible. I don't know. Maybe some tapes probably spawn later. Uh, it's a warehouse. Oh, I don't like the, I don't like the way this place looks. <clears throat> oh no. You know what they do at warehouses. Do you? Because I don't. No, don't leave. Wait. Okay. Alright. I feel like so I feel like it's about to go down, guys. I feel like this is the place where it goes down. Um what? Uh guys? Guys, what 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 is What the frick did I just Oh Um Can I leap? What Uh uh, there's a person. There's another. Per okay, bye. Um, maybe he was just gonna, you know, stop by the convenience store. Maybe get a snack. Did he just crash? Did I just hear him crash? 
Is that him? Did he crash? Okay, I don't know what I'm hearing. I don't know what I'm hearing. Okay, let me go back in here. I'm, I'm missing something, I feel like. Um, maybe I can try the UV flashlight? Oh, yeah! Okay, it's a code. <coughs> okay, so this one, the left one, uh, the second last door to the right, second last door to the left. Oh, no, what did I just do? <gasps> Hi! I can open. Okay. Is there... Oh, this is the brighter flash. All right. Oh. Voice recorder. Oh, yeah. I'm so glad I got this. Can I, um, pull out my flashlight? Oh, okay. All right, I'm just gonna leave. Just brute force it! I'm leaving! I'm... I'm not... Uh, wait. Okay, do I have to leave right? I have a burger. Do you want a burger? I believe it's bacon... It's bacon, egg, and cheese if you're from New York. Wait, I can interact with the light? Or is that just me interacting with the road? I, that might just be me. No, 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 just wait. Okay, do I have to leave? I got a voice recorder. What is... What, what, why, what, 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 why? Why? Can I play it? Can I... I can't do anything with the voice... Okay. Do I need this later on? Oh, no. Do, is there something else here? Oh, I really don't like exploring. Mm-mm, mm-mm. I don't like exploring. Nope, I don't like it. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm gone. Bye, bye. I got, I got what I need, I think. Bye, bye, bye. No more. No more, no more, no more. Time to go. Bye. I'm gone. I'm not here. Any, I'm not here anymore. Not here no more. Not here nowhere. Let's go. All right. So where do we go next? Uh, let's make sure nobody's uh about to break into my car. You know, no wild boars around here, right? <laughs> that would be boring. Get it, boar boy. Okay, boing. Uh, sorry. I don't. I'm. I. I actually don't have a condition. I'm just like this, unfortunately. Should I go to the house? Oh, there's like a little trash can icon right there. Maybe there's something down there. All right, I didn't get a tape recorder from here though. I got a voice recorder, but I didn't get like a tape. All right, let's let's go down. Maybe um maybe I do need to play these tapes in order for some another tape to spawn. Maybe that's what has to happen. Hold on, I have to I have to can I pause the game? I have, I have to change my battery. Okay, I oh at what cost? No, this is the wrong way. I think this is this is most definitely the wrong way. That boar is still there. I like again like I said before, Peta. I apologize. Um, that was not my fault. The game. It intended me to do that. There was, I believe there was no way around it. Um, he came at me. If anything, it was self-defense. Let's keep it real, Peter. okay? <laughs> let's, let, 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 let's not be unrealistic here. Where's that other car at? That dude just came out of nowhere. Like, is there somebody else here? I mean, I'm, there's other houses here, but like, I, I don't know, I, what was that? Just keep driving. I feel like there wouldn't be some, like, another car driving here unless they did that on purpose. You know what I mean? Alright, we'll go to the trash can icon next. Um, and then we'll also stop by the house since it's right near there after this. But hopefully something pops off here this time. Oh, or hopefully nothing does pop off. Although I hope something does pop, because that's my only content, you know? <laughs> Keeping it real. May the power of the Christmas tree compel you. Okay. Let's, um, let's go inside. I don't, did I, did I look around this place already? That's a nice keyboard. Honestly, you can put this stuff up for sale, like on eBay or something, you know? Okay, let's play, um, wait, is there, a oh, I can access my, oh, nice! Okay, that's, that's actually helpful. What did I got? A chicken burger. Oops. Um, well, I told him it was a bacon, egg, and cheese, so if he's from New York, he's gonna be very upset. All right, let's play this one. No, that was the sound that just happened in here. Nope. Nope. Who was there? Masakino. <laughs> What happened? You broke the TV. That was my gaming computer. <laughs> now let's start with the letter as always. We have a letter from Toko. It is the same person who sent us a letter last time. The last story was good, so I'm looking forward to this one as well. Wait, can I pause? Holy crap, do you guys remember the convenience store? When like you got sent that tape? No, that was a VHS tape. Oh, never mind. I'm stupid. All right, go ahead. My cousin was very depressed when her family got sick. They're gonna jump scare me. My cousin still always says that that was the lowest of her life. Still says that was the lowest of her life. Her family got sick, but she couldn't do anything, making her frustrated, anxious, and emotionally unstable. She became un unable to attend school. She didn't feel like doing anything. She spent her days looking at the sky and sigh. However, she had a one hope that she wouldn't be jump scared. It was her best friend. 
She had a friend she hit it off with at the elementary school, and they were very close. Her friend was worried about my cousin, so she came to her house every day. That's a true homie right there. And she listened uh, to her, and uh, the friend also talked about fun things at school and made her made my cousin laugh. Casting light on her dark days. That's a true homie, man. She even stayed over at the house a few times. Or sometimes. One day, my cousin was looking forward to her best friend coming. Oh no, what's about to happen? She casually looked at the clock and realized 30 minutes had passed uh, from her friend's usual arrival. Maybe her club is prolonged, um, or perhaps she's too busy to come today. Hmm. Cousin kept telling herself the tick tock sound from the clock became louder and louder. She thought she heard the ambulance siren in the distance. Oh no. Then. A phone call came in. Her best friend had a... Oh, no. Car accident. Her best friend was forever gone. Is that the ghost from the last story? She blamed herself and thought there was no point living anymore. She decided to commit suicide. When my cousin was about to throw herself off the bridge, she heard a voice calling her. <clears throat> Still, she tried to jump, but it called again. Not only that, but a girl's face appeared in front of her this time. It was the face of her best friend. But why? She was so surprised and overwhelmed. She broke down and cried. I'm gonna break down and cry. And she stopped suicide. I don't think that's how that works, but I know what you mean. It was just that one time. And after that, still her friend is always, will always be special. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, time to go. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. No more. Bye. Oh wait, I have another one. Can we just, is that a tractor? Can we just read this next time? Please, I don't want to go back in. Guys, I think I need a break from going in. I, I can't. Ah, okay. Frick it. Oh my, I heard, when she said it was her best friend, the, the voice then glitched out. You guys heard that, right? Oh no, oh my gosh. Oh man, the door, what was that? I can't, I seriously can't do this. Holy, mother of mackerel. Yay, back at horror story. We're back at it again, let's get it. What kind of story will come out this time? I don't know. Let's read the letter. Uh, it's from Toko. Not Toko again. I don't. It's this person again. Why do you say it like that? It's kind of rude. Stories from Toko sends us are very heartwarming ghost stories. Yeah, but you know. I feel like that's not what this game is about to be. What kind of ghost will come out this time? No, oh, see, this is, I think it was my friend, oh, wait, I think this was when my friend was a high school student, my fam my friend's family was hospitalized, so she went to the hospital every day, okay, uh -huh. the hospital was a, was a polyclinic with many doctors and nurses, and people were always going in and out of it, pause, <laughs> sorry, very immature. Maybe it was that time of the year when staffs are shuffled around. She felt there were many changes in people. She stopped seeing familiar nurses and saw many new nurses. As usual, she went to the hospital to visit her family and she passed by a new nurse in the corridor. I gotta stop looking around. Because the nurse came from the direction of the room where her family is, the nurse killed her She casually asked her family, new nurse came again? Question mark. But her family replied, Who were you talking about? Can this light, like, not flicker, please? If she's a nurse from before, Oh wait, is she a nurse from before or from a different room? But I sure remember her coming out of my family's room. What? So she's a, she's a ghost then? Many questions came to mind, but I tried not to think about them anymore. Then a middle-aged woman in the next bed spoke to them. She said, because it's a hospital, things happen. Okay, so the hospitals are a hot spot for ghosts. She smiled and gave and little. She smiled a little and gave one candy e each to my family and me. Don't take that! The lady was admirable and charming. Yeah, and she put freaking razor blades in your gummy bears. When I came to visit my family a few days later, I stayed too long, and the vacation or the visitation time was left short. 
After I went to the bathroom, I headed to my family's room to say goodbye before returning home. Then I saw the door open uh, of the room where my family was and the nurse I saw before came out. For some reason, I quickly hid and as I watched, she came out with the lady in the bed next to her family. Okay. The lady was walking hand in hand with the nurse. I immediately entered the room where my family wasn't asked about. When my family told me that the lady wandered out of the room alone, I heard, hurriedly chased them. Oh, crap. I saw the lady and the nurse. Ma'am, ma'am, I called from behind. But as if they didn't hear me, they didn't respond. Of course. The nurse does not look back at me and walks together. Uh-oh. Something bad's about to happen. The two stopped in front of the elevator, so I ran to them. Uh-oh. I finally caught up to them in the elevator, uh, on the elevator and was able to grab the lady's arm in the elevator. Ma'am, are you all right? When I said that, the nurse glared at me and disappeared. Oh! It's just me and the lady who doesn't remember anything on the elevator! Okay! The B2 button was pressed! As I learned later, the second basement floor was the morgue! Okay. Where did the nurse intend to take this lady? Three out of seven. Time to go. I'm looking down. Time to go. I'm going to my car. I don't want any problems. Leave. Oh my. Oh my gosh. No, please don't. Don't. They are. I can't pause. They are building the tension so heavily right now. Look, look at my headphone. I, 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 I didn't even consciously do that. I'm keeping an eye out. Maybe there's like a jump scare or not. I guess it wouldn't be a jump scare, but maybe like there's like a creepy, something creepy in the shadows or in the trees that I don't see. So I'm trying to pay attention. Do you guys see that? That was the car that we saw earlier. The trash area. Yeah, sure. Let's go. Nothing bad's going to happen, right? Oh, that's my car. Okay. Okay, the car. Leave the area. No, wait. What is this? Stop! What is a tape? Oh no. Pull out my flashlight. Why do they keep taking stop taking away my flashlight, man? Where's my where's my There it is. Lock padlock. Okay, I need a key to the door. What oh, what is this? Rats seem hungry. Huh? Oh! Give them a burger! Oh, it's like in the convenience store! Or not wait, was it the convenience store? No, uh not the convenience store. It's like, um, please don't jump scare me. Oh my gosh, I thought that smoke was a face. It's like, uh, what was that? What was that one? Night delivery. When you had to give the cat food. I remember that. Okay. All right. Well, uh, I think my job here is done. If I find a key to a padlock, I'll make sure to uh, definitely come back over here. Do I have a key? No. Okay. I do have a UV flashlight. Is there something on the UV flashlight that I can see? Uh, it keeps prompting me to leave whenever I go next to the car again, so... I guess I'll just leave. Wait, no, before I leave, I want to make sure I have my flashlight in hand because I don't want to be without it when I get out of the car. Is the car making weird noises every time I get in it? I feel like it's starting to make weirder and weirder noises. <clears throat> All right, so we need one more tape after this, right? Or do we need two more tapes after this? <gasps> what is that noise? My car. What is my car doing? My car is braking. My car is breaking. It's slowly, well, it's probably because I keep freaking crashing it. So my car is breaking down slowly. I wonder, if that's why my car has been making weird no- What? Uh, guys, I'm coasting. I'm coasting. I'm co- I'm not actually driving, I'm just coasting. Guys, the car is broken. I can't leave. Holy fr frick you. The car, I can't move. The car is broken, I can't leave the car- <clears throat> No. <laughs> She's in my trunk. I have I have junk in my trunk literally. I'm sweating everywhere and I mean everywhere. Sorry, that's descriptive. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and uh, head back to the radio station cuz <laughs> nothing bad's going to happen. You know what? The more they jump scare me or the more they scare me in general, the more Oh, there's a building over there. The more they scare me in general, I feel like I'm gonna be like okay when they actually jump scare me for 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 the big time, the one time, you know. What? There's a, somebody in there, huh? Hello. Oh, okay, yeah, no, that's normal. There's something odd about this monitor. Break it, huh? I have to pay for that. I feel like. Oh, that was a <laughs> casual break. Oh, but tape. Oh, so do you guys remember? I know I keep bringing up the convenience store. Uh, uh, uh oh, I thought something was gonna be out that window. Do go. 
Hi. Well, that was rude. Okay, well now I have three tapes. I have one, two, three, and a voice recorder. Yay. Horror story, hello there. I will read horror letters as always. This is a letter from Toko. This person has become familiar. What kind of story is it this time? The story of a girl I met recently at my part-time job. Depressing days has passed since... Wait, depressing days have passed since her brother... Oh, frick. The girl went to the hospital every day for her brother and was taking good care of him. I'm sorry, I can't read very well, in case you guys can't tell. <laughs> sorry. What? This is the same person as usual, right? Yeah, it's Toko. Excuse me. The writing style is different from usual, so I thought it was another person. Let's get back to the story. When I went to the brother, when I went to the hospital as usual, my brother, my brother's doctor, why did it stop up? To? What? Huh? Excuse me? What is happening? Capital letters are used in weird places. I will continue. My brother's doctor was standing in front. He guided me into another room. And after some time, there's not time, much time left. Why is he reading so fast? I went to my brother's room and there he was smiling as always. After that, I tried to get to the, go to the hospital as much as possible when I had time. Like so, the month has passed. And it's been three months since I talked with the doctor. I didn't get to read what it said. He was... The subtitles are a little broken, it seems like. It was a little colder than usual that day. On the way to the hospital, a little boy called me. Mom? I'm not your mom. Like, what are you talking about, kid? The boy almost started crying when I said so. I am your mom. I'm just kidding. So I decided to look for the boy's mother. Soon, we found his mom and I handed him over. The baby's mom, or the boy's mom saw me as I was... She said, my house is right around the corner. Please come and rest. I didn't realize... So I accept. Why is it going so fast? Boy's mom served me a cup of tea. Uh, I sighed in relief and made myself relax for the first time in a long time. Such a sweet life. Such, such a sweet time has passed by in the blink of an eye. I looked at the clock and there was only one hour left till the end of our visit of the visit time. I didn't feel like I stayed that long. It'll take 30 minutes from here to the hospital. Oh, okay, I see. I left the house immediately. I forgot to say a proper goodbye. Well, that's kind of rude. So I turned around and there was no house. What? Ghost houses? But I had no time to think about it. No time? I'll be thinking about it the whole time. My cell phone rang as I rushed out. I didn't notice the soft sound in my pocket. When I arrived at the hospital, a little boy looking for, or looked like my brother stood in front of the door. What? I found that strange and approached him. I felt like the boy asked, what are you doing when I was suffering in pain? I entered the hospital in a hurry, but it was too late. Was that his brother as a kid? Or a ghost brother as a kid? I called my brother's name and crowd loudly. loudly. Why? At, at the moment, I felt something strange that was coming. <laughs> it's the caps again. It's not the cap, sorry. Min was in capital letters. I can't, I can't do Since then, my brother is always watching me by my side. But was the boy your brother at the front door? Always. What the frick? That was this? Oh, no. Wait, but it still says four of seven. Okay, play this one. Oh my gosh, guys. What the frick? What the frick? Please just play it. I'm just happy that this radio has had such amazing feedback lately. So I'll be reading as always. Somebody's not. Guys, where is that knocking coming from? Is it... Oh my gosh, where is this knocking coming from? Is it... Uh, that's uh, uh, where's, uh, I'm sorry, I'm missing the story, but somebody's knocking. Uh, oh, my, are you hi? Hi. Oh, okay. My friends and relatives, no one was around me. I'm sorry, I, I missed. I, I was trying to do that. That was a little weird. 
There were some in the previous letter too. He's talking about the capitalizations. It's not like I can't read it, but well, I don't want the story to stop, so I'll read it without being bothered by it as much as possible. <sighs> Let's continue. No, they were gone. When I noticed, it was just my brother and me. It was unforgivable. Everything was. Wait, is this a code? S isn't a capital letter. Wait, is this a code that I've been supposed to pay attention to the whole time? <laughs> Everything. I hope for everyone's unhappy knee. Knee? Knee? He has bad knees? Oh, unhappiness. Oh, yeah, yeah, unhappiness. As I said, it's a little hard to read when there are capital letters like this. Excuse me. I will continue. I always wrote Curtis, courtesy. Guys, what is happening? I, can't, I wrote down everything I saw. It would be much easier if I could speak Japanese. I believe it's Japanese. Such letter, letters resonate with the reader's heart. I like to see the person's face when they read it. Bringing feast to our world. My brother is always next to me. With a worried look. I hold his hand. Wait. Oh, crap. Wait. I will do what I couldn't when my brother went to sleep. Guys, I got chills. Forget all the grief and sadness. People often die around me. I'm tearing up. I wonder if it's my fault. Oh, no. I think I know what's happening. You'll see. I'm coming to see you, too. Something is written at the bottom. Have you read my letter? Mm. Yeah, mm. it's all in capital letters. Mm. Little strange, huh? That's a little strange. Just a little bit, not too much. Just a little strange. Letter? Question mark? Do you mean this? I think he means this. What do you mean? He means that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Letter? Yep, yep, the letter, yep, the letter, yep. Mm. Okay, I'll look for it. Huh? If I find it, I will read it next time. Is that blood? No, that's a shadow. Five out of seven. Uh, okay, I have another one. This is the last one that I have. Something's, something's hor something horrible is about to happen. Okay, wait. Real quick before this starts. Hold on, can I get out? Can I... Masagi's Horror Story! Thanks for joining us again! Okay, real quick, I want to say this. I think what's happening here is the ghost is writing these letters. The ghost is writing these letters and he's sending them to this person so he can read it and broadcast it to everyone in the neighborhood or in this little town. And everybody in this little town died because this ghost haunted them to death. Imagine haunting someone so hard that they die. I mean, you gotta be a certified G to do that. It's a stretch! But I'm assuming that's what at least happened to him. Because notice how he's talking about how he's getting a lot of traction at his radio station. I think those who listened to the last show will understand. We found the letter! Yay! We found the letter! I didn't notice it because it was sandwiched between the documents. A sandwich I could really kill for. So I'm gonna read this letter for today. Yeah! What kind of story is it this time? Uh, a horror story. This time as well, it is a story from Toka. Well, duh. There seems to be something like a title this time. Oh, yay! Title. Let's start reading from the title. Okay. I'm down. What? Dots? Oh, she made the book for, like, people who couldn't, like, read or and were deaf. So, like, they could read the little dots. What? That's it? tape ends abruptly. What happens after that? He was about to read a letter. It should be between some documents. No. I'm gonna find... Oh, no. Oh, no. My camera's about to... I have to find it. Oh, no. Oh, this is really not good. Oh, this is really not good. 
Oh no, guys, this is really not good. Is it? Oh my gosh, I hear something. Maybe I'm just bugging. Maybe there's no ghosts. Uh, maybe it's just like a person playing an elaborate hoax. <laughs> you know, guys, maybe somebody's just <laughs> playing a little prankste, little social experiment, you know? <laughs> maybe in the fridge. Ah, nope. Uh, can I grab some water? Like, is my dude not thirsty at all? Oh, in here. Oh, right here. Oh, yeah. This is a good idea. There's a sticky note on the paper. Read this aloud and you'll know why your brother died. Wait, should I? Re I read it. Oh, no. Well, I'm stupid. The darkness. <laughs> Little brother burns <laughs> hot and the older sister, sister exhales. Exhale. Tanako leap. God, Lee is reading fast. Not a ray of light can be seen in the darkness. I, it is, is it a monster that I see over there? Even if I invite him, he doesn't move. The ugly side casts off the vestige. Uh, there is no island or color ahead. One bone of a wanderer who wouldn't keep up with the white rabbit. Who is changing? Is it me? Or is it someone else? Even if you put the monster beside you, reflection in the mirror only shows darkness. I fall and I fall, and yet I haven't fallen. There's nothing at my destination. Toko. Oh man, I'm dead. Oh man, I'm so dead. Oh man. I can't open the door. Oh, I'm about to drown in blood. Oh, this is how I want to go. This is how I want to go. Yeah, baby. This is how I want it to go. Oh, drowning in blood. Yes, sir. I can't move. I can crouch. Can I, can I just crouch and drown myself? Oh, there's ripples over there. Oh, there's somebody over on that part. Well, I'll just stay over here. This is my territory. You know, this desk in between, that just that's a, that's a line in the sand. You can't come over here. Oh, uh, hi. Well, how you doing? Oh, are you the dude that I saw earlier? Oh, is that Toko? Hi, Toko. I heard a lot about you. Please don't jump scare me. Uh, Toko. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> Do I have to walk over to you? That seems like I'm an... Oh, I left? I just left the room? Oh, no, it's a cutscene. <laughs> I'm hurt. You should not read the darkness of Tanako. If you read it, you will die. I don't have much time left. What? That's my own fault that I died. I read the letter. Uh, I, I'm drowning. I think I'm drowning. Now's not the time. That, that was very inconsiderate of the situation. I can't see anything. Something's happening. I can't move. It's still a cutscene. Um... Is she drowning me? I'm being drowned. This is an unfortunate situation. Help! I can't breathe! Ending three. Oh! Wait, there's three endings? Have you guys heard about the uh, darkness of Tanako? Hmm? No clue what it is. Isn't that the if you read your doomed thing? What do you mean by doomed? Someone is singing about the darkness of Tanako. I've heard that you shouldn't read it out loud. But no one's what the original poem is. The darkness is added lines and changed by many people, right? So it's a poem. No! What should I do? I was fooled into reading it out loud. What? Typo. Little brother. Br oh no. I'm not. Re I'm not reading it out loud. I'm not reading. I already read it out loud. <laughs> Checking my six and my twelve. That's not funny. If you think you're doing us a favor, well, you're not. But if someone reads it, R.I.P. <laughs> LMAO. <laughs> Lettuce, mayo, and onions. Uh, did you know they found a voice memo that says not read the... Uh, uh, I'm not reading the title was found. This is my first time hearing about the darkness of Tanako. And I'm freaking out. I'm going to read it. Stop it, seriously. Just let just let them do whatever. They're going to read it anyways. Who is the person who recorded it? What happened to that person? I heard that the person read it and recorded it right away because he thought it was dangerous. You shouldn't read it, and if you read it, you're doomed, are basically the same. You should be more specific about what will happen. Aren't they awesome? Respect. <laughs> Those who read blank will die out, or aloud will die. English. Man, I suck at reading. Is it over? Can I put on my second headphone? Is this okay? Are we good? Guys, I don't want to put on... Stop being a pansy. Is it over? Oh. And then you're gonna hit us with this. Well, it didn't even. There we go. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. It's not enough. If, if the beat drops, you know they have like a little beat drop. I might have to go crazy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Give, give it, give it five more seconds. Other three. Other two. 
A one? Well, it didn't. I mean, kind of. Uh, all alone in this radio station. It's getting kind of dark. Getting kind of lonely. I'm all alone. <clears throat> I need my UV light. Is that a handprint I see? Oh no. I feel like I need to get out here. Get out of here. Just read a note about Toko. Uh, it's time to go. Walk out the front doors, hop in the whip, hit a boar by accident. That's boring. Mm. Uh. What a load of. Uh. Don't call Peter though. Mm. Might have to hit you with a PDW though. Mm. Cause I'm a W. Mm. Take no L's. Even when I get jump scared, I'm still OL. I don't know what OL means. Overloaded. Overloaded on these weights, I be hitting the barbell. Mm. Localization. I didn't even word, read that word right. GVM Luca movies for the Vietnamese. Mm. I can't read that name for English. Support us over at Patreon at Chilla's Art. I'll hit you up, Chilla's Art. I'll go ahead and send that bag. If you like the game, please leave a review. Thank you for playing. Come on, guys. If that doesn't get you in your feels, <laughs> I don't. Is that how you guys felt about my, my my song? You guys are just gonna go crickets on me? Well, all right, you guys, that was the radio station. Wow, look, Chilla's art just knocks it out of the park like every single time. I like how they always change the type of game. You know, it has the same ambiance, the same, like the same unsettling feeling. Every single game is different somehow. Like the radio station, that was a reading based game. So that was that was that was really cool, and I feel like they kind of wanted, like, uh, especially commentators. You know what I mean? Like people who actually play the game and record videos on it, gameplay videos. They wanted them to have to read it out loud. You know what I mean? So it's kind of like you are the radio station guy. Well, with all that being said, man, that was that was the radio station. Chilla's art. Again, shout out to you guys. I know you guys probably don't know who I am, but oh, also I want to thank you guys for 900 subscribers. That is amazing. That is like literally. There's a Christmas tree in my background. That doesn't have anything to do with anything, but I just saw it, and I thought that was pretty cool. But thank you guys for 900 subscribers. I normally say everything, and I normally give you guys all my thanks in the beginning of the video. Um, but this time, I left it for the end. Why? Because you gotta say the best for last sometimes. That me up. If you guys made it this far through the video, thank you. This video obviously isn't gonna have as much edits as um, my previous videos, but it'll still have some here and there. I don't want it to ruin the flow of the game. Also. You guys thought I forgot. Let me say a quick prayer, okay? So we don't get cursed. This is the armor of God, okay? Um, oh, Heavenly Father, I pray that we do not get any neck. Now, if this is real, you know, if any of this is real, that none of this energy, none of this evil energy rubs off on me or any of the viewers because we are armed with the armor of God and we are covered in the blood of Jesus. Can I get an amen? I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video, hopefully tomorrow. I'm not, oh, I... I see, I, I was confident that I wasn't sweating and, you, and then that showed up and that was, sorry. And I'll see you in the next video tomorrow. Peace. <sighs> that was a lot. <laughs>